For a long time, I've been trying to understand with these smart DLP projectors just what exactly is meant by this thing that you don't have to clean the projector, there's no filters, and so it's supposed to be low maintenance and so forth. Well, we've had these projectors now for over five years, and we're starting to have projectors developing problems and that they need to be replaced out of warranty. So this means that we now have units that are failing and would have to be repaired or replaced and this means since they're out of warranty I can take them apart and see what's inside. So we've replaced one Smart UF55 and I took it apart and I discovered that inside it has a, do a device that looks like this. This is the micro mirror array or the, the digital mirror that produces the image. There are millions of tiny mechanical mirrors on this little silver area right here and it turns out that this is a sealed component. There is a sheet of glass over the top of this so I can't actually touch the mirrors this is completely sealed. So this is dust free. There's no way that dust can get in here and interfere with this. So this part right here, there's no way to contaminate it and make it fail. So this is what they're talking about. However, as you've seen with my other videos, there's still plenty of ways for dust to get into the smart projector optics in other places that causes the color wheel to malfunction or we get little fibers inside the lens somewhere so it's 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 part it's it's somewhat sealed but not completely now um, the the Epson power light projectors that I've worked with also for the last five years those have filters and you know I've never had to take those down for cleaning never once had to mess with them they just work and it turns out that even though this micromere array is sealed, it's still not without its own problems. Here, for example, is a projector which is going to have to be replaced because the micromere array is failing. See all these little dots all over the place? Each one of these dots is a failed mirror. The little mirror on there has stopped flipping back and forth and it's either stuck in a fully bright or fully dark position. Well, sometimes you get a little gray where it's just stuck halfway. So you, you notice that there are black dots as well as light dots. These are dead pixels. They're stuck. They will never move again. They're inside that sealed device. There's nothing I could do to try and make them move. The only option is to just take the projector down and replace the whole thing. Now, if you look at the documentation for the Micromere Array, which, by the way, is made by Texas Instruments, you will see that they say, oh, Micromere Array should last maybe 40,000 hours, 30, 40, 50,000 hours, maybe. Well, let's just see how long this projector has lasted. I'll go into the service menu and we will take a look at what the service menu says for this projector. We can read it through all this. Okay, so here we have display hour, which is the total operating life for this projector. Oh, 3,547 hours. Hmm, that seems significantly short of 20, 30, 40, 50,000 hours like Texas Instruments is suggesting it's supposed to last. This is way, way short of the expected lifespan of the Micromere Array. Now, um, I also discovered that Texas Instruments offers a five-year warranty on the Micromere Array, and um, it's something that Smart started doing also, and it, it makes me wonder if actually Smart was actually offering Texas Instruments warranty rather than their own warranty. But anyway, um, even so, the five-year warranty is still not long enough, as you can see here. 
we're only up to 3500 hours and it's already failing so this projector is unfortunately being replaced with a brand new one there it just doesn't look worth it to try and repair the old one and also there does not appear to be any information on how to replace a micromere array yourself so you have to pay smart service company to replace the array plus also the service fees on top of that if you want to get it fixed <laughs>